In today's video, you'll see some weird creatures that you can only find in the Mariana Trench. There's a worm that feeds on bones, a fish with eyes that looks like a barrel, and of course, we have a creature that you can see its internal organs. But first, let's look at this fish that can swallow you alive. Number 10. The Goblin Shark the first time you set your eyes on the goblin shark, you'd want to think you're watching something straight out of a sci-fi movie. But look, this creature exists right here in the Mariana Trench. Its sword-like protruding flat snout is enough to scare you. And if you thought you'd seen it all, wait until you look below its snout, and you'd be surprised to see a set of jaws with large teeth that can crush you in seconds. It uses a combination of sight, smell, and electro detection to hunt and ambush its prey. This scary-looking beast is indeed huge, measuring up to 3 meters in length. The goblin shark tends to dive deeper as they age, but typically they can cruise away down to 920 meters below the water surface. More research is underway to discover more about its reproduction pattern and lifespan, but all we know is that it feeds on fish species like dragonfish and cephalopods. Well, you can be sure that no one wants to meet such a creature. Number 9. The Frilled Shark if the goblin shark wasn't nerve-chilling enough, we've got something that can scare you even more. And sure enough, the frilled shark is the last deep-sea creature you'd wish to come across while swimming or doing your normal scuba dive. In fact, its wide mouth and eel-like body are enough to scare you to death. It's no wonder it's nicknamed the living fossil thanks to its odd appearance, which hasn't changed over millions of years. And with its set of 300 needle-like teeth inside its scary mouth, you can be sure this chilling monster can grind its prey mercilessly in just a few minutes. Its favorite meals include smaller sharks, fish, and cephalopods. And even though it lives more than 5,000 meters below the water's surface, it was one of the first deep-sea animals to be discovered in the 19th century. Number 8. The Dumbo Octopus the Dumbo octopus is one of the strange creatures found in the Mariana Trench. It's an umbrella octopus that has two large floppy fins, one on either side of the mantle, that protrudes like an elephant's ears, which helps it to swim around. But despite this unwelcoming look, you'd be surprised that it's considered the cutest octopus in the world. It has a small gelatinous body measuring about 30 centimeters, which is designed to withstand extreme pressure down in the deep sea. Another strange thing you'll notice about the Dumbo octopus is that it has eight tiny tentacles, which help it to walk along the seabed. But unlike other species of octopi that live near the water surface, the Dumbo octopus occupies the deepest part of the ocean, hovering at about 13,000 feet below the water surface. This makes them the deepest living octopi known. In case you're wondering, the Dumbo octopus feeds on worms and amphipods, among other crustaceans. And it's known to pounce on its prey and swallow them whole to be digested in their bodies slowly. Number 7. The Telescope Octopus Talk of deep sea beauty and most likely the telescope octopus will top the list. It is another strange species of octopus found in the Mariana Trench. It looks like something out of a fairy tale, and it's without a doubt one of the most peculiar creatures you can find in the Mariana Trench. The first thing that makes the telescope octopus peculiar is that it's entirely transparent, making it difficult for predators to notice it. In fact, the only part of its body that is visible is its eyes and digestive gland. Its eyes give it a wider peripheral vision to allow the octopus to see predators and prey alike. Additionally, its eyes can rotate to offer the creature an even better way to see through the darkness of the deep sea. And should a predator pursue it, the telescope octopus drifts in a vertical posture along with the ocean current to escape. The telescope octopus also has a delicate webbing between each of its eight tentacles, which gives this creature a ghostly shape. But you'll not find them at the seabed or in the shallow waters like their sister occupy. They inhabit the open ocean at a depth ranging from 150 meters to 2 kilometers below the water surface. Number 6. Pink See-Through Fantasia The pink see-through Fantasia is another transparent deep-sea creature that will surprise you. This incredible creature is a pink-colored, free-swimming cucumber that's so clear you can see its internal organs. It is perfectly adapted to its deep sea environment by having bioluminescent photophores which emit light to alarm potential predators whenever it's in danger. And did I mention that this pink creature lives as deep as 2,500 meters below sea level? Well, with its finger-like webbing under their bodies, you can be sure that they can move perfectly in those high-pressure zones. It feeds on the benthic sediments at the ocean bottom. The pink see-through Fantasia is a creature just about anyone would want to hear more about. But sadly, it was only discovered recently in 2007, so not much is known about it. But we hope scientists will uncover more about this strange creature. Number 5. Deep Sea Dragonfish 
If there is one terrifying deep sea creature located in the Mariana Trench you'd never wish to meet, then it's none other than the deep sea dragonfish. It is characterized by large, sharp, and transparent fang-like teeth, which are large enough that it can't close its mouth perfectly. These large teeth give it a scary look, but they are there for a purpose, and that's to help grab prey in its deep sea environment. But one special feature of the deep sea dragonfish is that it has bioluminescent photophores along the side of its body, which help it to create a reddish light to attract prey and mate. And to help it with hunting, it also has a protruding photophore on its chin, which acts as a fishing pole to entice potential prey. Now, that's enough to tell you that the deep sea dragonfish is indeed a vicious predator. It measures about 6 inches and hovers more than 1600 feet under the surface of the ocean. Number 4. Deep Sea Hatchetfish Talk of the ugliest deep sea creature that you're likely to meet in the Mariana Trench, and I'll tell you with confidence that it's the deep sea hatchetfish. This rather sour looking creature got its name from its thin blade like body shape, which resembles a handheld hatchet. But one strange thing about the deep sea hatchetfish is that it uses its bioluminescent light along its bellies and sides as an ingenious method of camouflage to avoid predators or attract prey. It has large, tubular eyes that point upwards, enabling it to search for food falling from above. And because there is little light at the great depth where they inhabit, deep-sea hatchetfish have become very sensitive to light, being able to distinguish between shadows against the extremely faint illumination from above. Number 3. The Barrel Eye Fish Depending on where the animal lives, it adapts to the surrounding environment. And sure enough, the barrel eye fish has adapted to the dark, deep sea environment by compensating for its eye size. It has unusual barrel shaped eyes that are large and pointed upwards to make it a super hunter deep down the waters. Even scarier about this fish is that its head has a transparent dome which compensates for enough light and protects it from being stung when it feeds on a jellyfish. They use their large fins to quickly pounce on their prey when the right time comes. Well, much as scientists have tried to uncover more about the barrel eye fish, much still remains unknown about it. Some of the areas of interest that scientists are yet to discover about this weird looking creature are its reproduction pattern and its life cycle. Number 2. The Sea Devil Anglerfish I'm pretty sure you're quite aware of this fish, especially if you're a fan of the popular film Finding Nemo, which used the fish as a scary creature. However, if you're a deep sea diver and you're interested to have a look at this scary fish, then I'm sorry to disappoint you, because this creature is among the rarely seen deep sea fishes. In fact, it was until 2014 that scientists managed to record this video of the sea devil anglerfish in its natural habitat after many years of research. Its strangely shaped body, popping eyes, and sharp teeth make this fish one of the scariest deep sea creatures you'll ever meet in the Mariana Trench. One strange feature of this fish is its fishing pole, which is located on its head. The fishing pole has a shining spot at the tip which helps it to attract prey to close vicinity for an easy catch. Though they are smaller in size, measuring between 1 to 8 inches, the sea devil anglerfish can swallow meals much larger than their size, thanks to their large gaping jaw and sharp teeth. The fish reproduces in a rather strange way, where the male fuses into the female and lives off her resources until it can produce sperm. Number 1. Zombie Worm Ever stop to ask why the ocean bed is not full of decaying bones despite the many animals that die in the ocean? Well, just like the land is full of creatures that break down decaying matter, the ocean bed also has creatures that complete the ecosystem, and one of them is the zombie worm. As its name suggests, the zombie worm is a vicious born eater that keeps the ocean floor free of bones. It's known to bore into bones of decaying whales to reach enclosed lipids on which they feed for sustenance. You might be wondering how the worm can bore into something as hard as cement, right? Well, the zombie worm has special root tissues that secrete acid to help them drill into bones. And when it comes to digestion, they use symbiotic bacteria to digest the proteins and lipids they find in the bones. Now, as much as this acid-producing scavenger may sound scary to man, it doesn't pose any risk to a man, unless you are, of course, a decaying whale on the ocean bed. Thanks for watching.